Are you ready for another cocktail with fancy girl drinks? Then stick around. Today we are featuring specialty martinis. So we have three martinis that we're going to sample today and show um, my partner here is going to show you how to make. I'm your sister. Okay. <laughs> but anyway, yes, we have three specialty martinis. So by the time we get to the end, we're going to be feeling no pain. No pain. No pain, no gain. No pain, So no what's pain. the first one uh, we're making? We're going to do a cucumber watermelon. If you see, we got all this... Lovely fruits and vegetables because it's the uh, season, you know, watermelons at the peak. So we're going to yeah. add in That's two good. cups of watermelon. Woo. We're going to do, um, utilize all the fruits that are in season yes. and uh, yes, make yes. the specialty martini, you know, geared towards the fruit that is in season right now. If I'm not drinking Prosecco, then it's going to be a martini. Those are my two drinks of choice. Uh, unless I'm, you know, maybe drinking margarita. gin, vodka, or bourbon. Uh, maybe, maybe a margarita, too, from time to time. But uh, my drink of choice is either uh, is a, is a martini, probably 90% of the time going out. So I'm traditionally, martinis were made with... Um, vodka, right? Vodka, vodka gin. and gin. Oh, it was, a, was it originally gin? Yeah, I think it. I think gin. it was originally gin martini. Right. So if you know, let us know. If, um, if we're not, if vodka came before gin or gin came before vodka, if you know, uh, comment down below and let us know. But I think gin was the gin martini was first. I think so. Anyway, I don't particularly um, care for gin martini, except for you know I had something recently. It was a gin pomegranate martini. Hmm. Ooh, it was good. So. I was surprised the gin, something about the elder berries, the elderberry flower in, uh, mm -hmm. flower in gin. So, uh, so gin has an elderberry flower in it, I believe. It's made with elderberry. Juniper. 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 That's the one. I knew it was some kind of flower. Juniper. So, yeah. juniper flower. So, the, the taste of a juniper flower and the taste of pomegranate together, it was like, I didn't think it would be good. Try it. It's delicious. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That's interesting. Gin pomegranate martini. Yeah. So to oh, our so watermelon, watermelon juice, we're gonna add. Mm -hmm. gonna add? We're gonna add two ounces of cucumber syrup. Mm -hmm. So I just made a simple syrup, and I steep uh, a whole cucumber. I sliced it. I peeled it first, sliced it, and uh, steeped it in the simple syrup. A cup of sugar, a cup of water, cut up the cucumber, and then you know what? So do I, you boil it? You don't boil it. You boil cucumber. it. Yeah, you boil it. Oh. But you don't like continuously boil it. Boil it for maybe like. Mm, couple minutes then turn it off let it cool and steep in there and okay. so I just added some extra cucumber in there let it sit in the refrigerator for a couple of days and then when I tasted it it was kind of sweet to me so I added oh, I don't even you see add, you know I'm a cucumber girl do you girl. see the jalapenos uh I do not see the jalapenos I think they're back on the oh yeah they're over uh, there the other Bring me a jalapeno over there please production this is our production crew behind us production can you uh toss a jalapeno over here, please. No, don't toss it, cause I'm gonna not catch it. Let me see if I can catch it. No, oh, I, I have a. She's wait, not gonna catch it. I had a broken foot, now I have a broken finger. Yeah. Let me let me try. So now, put her eye, put her eye out. Just <laughs> go ahead okay. with it. All right. Try, okay. Toss it. Toss it. Okay. Here we toss, go. Here we now go. then, you missed. Oh, it. See, oh I got it. I got it. I got it with the help of that hairy hair. With the help, with the help of hair and, and chest <laughs> and the clavicle. <laughs> so. This came out of our garden. Isn't that beautiful? So That's what I did good. was That's I took pretty. one of these and I sliced the top off and poked some holes in it and I dropped it in there because it was kind of sweet. So you already did that? I already did that. I know she pre-made the uh, cucumber syrup and you did that already. Yeah, because it was kind of oh, sweet. I was like, ooh, no, I bet we, you that's spicy we now. We need something spicy because it was yeah. just too sweet. So okay, how many that's ounces a good did idea. I say? I said two ounces. Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. So we're going to put two ounces of cucumber syrup. Cucumber syrup. That's two right there, but it seems like so, we need a little bit more. Someone watermelon, cucumber syrup. That's the only two ingredients so far, right? So far, yes. Okay. Your spicy cucumber syrup. Spicy cucumber syrup, yes. That was my own little extra touch. Okay, okay. so now we're going to add the vodka. Vodka, <laughs> time for the good stuff. Yeah. The, the main ingredient. 
we gotta add. Oh, I gotta elevate this foot of mine. Oh, here we go. Here we go with the foot drama. Okay. It's almost though. Probably a couple more weeks. Hopefully, probably you can enjoy the Labor three. Day weekend. The the only thing that I'm really concerned about is the next time I get dressed up, can I put on my heels? Mm. I I'm hoping that I will be able to wear heels. I've got a couple of events coming up. Got my little fit all together and and then you're gonna have to put on a it hush calls. puppy. <laughs> I know, right? I don't even know what a hush puppy is. The way a hush puppy looks like a what a desert boot. <laughs> oh, that's what a hush puppy looks like. When I was in the third or fourth grade, desert boots were uh, they called them desert boots. I guess now they're kind of kind of like a what do they call them now? The Chelsea. Oh, kind of re re remember it, it's kind of close to a Chelsea boot. Back in the day, they called it a desert boot. Oh, if anybody okay. remember, I'm, I'm, I'm dating myself okay, now. Moving my towel. That's what if I'm anybody remembers uh, wearing towel. desert boots when you were growing up, then um, holler at me. So, okay, <laughs> where we at? We okay, at? so I've got all my greens in here. Let me make sure. Oh no, I don't. See, I always leave something out. I always. What is do. it? I need the lime. Okay, I'm okay. gonna squeeze. So, I have a lime. Watermelon. Yeah, cut down some of that sweetness. Cucumber syrup. Lime. Vodka. Vodka going yet? Vodka is in. It's already in. Okay. So we're gonna squeeze a little lime because we got a lot of sweetness going on in here. Thank okay. you for the towel. Come on. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, crew, crew, crew number one. We got yeah. crew one and Somebody crew two. Somebody keeps taking my towel. Crew one and crew two. You can't run a bar without having behind a, the scene. A bar you time. gotta have a bar tie. That's essential. Yeah. Uh, people, when you're setting up your bar, that's one of when you get your shaker and you get your ice bucket and your muddler. Don't forget your bar towels. You really need a stack of at least a half a dozen of bar towels Dang, at all times. you really making a, a mess. <laughs> well, sometimes you might have to twist the bottle. Sometimes you yeah. gotta make a little mess. You know, then you got a, a, a extra towel in the back in case you spill so yeah you need at least you need as many bar towels as you can get so now for this martini we're going to use uh, a tr traditional martini glass there's different shapes of martini glasses we're going to explain these as we make our other drinks our other, other martinis but we're going to use the <laughs> traditional which has the production you're making too much shapes. noise in the background i can hear everything you do in production <laughs> Production trying to slip and get something to drink. <laughs> okay. All the drinks are up here. All right. So, so oh, I need to put some ice in there. Who wants a hot martini? Oh, have you? I didn't even see you shake it yet. Did you shake it? I shook it. I shook it and I stirred it. Oh. Well, I missed all that. I don't know. Shucking and jiving. You talking about that boots talking about <laughs> me Reminiscing. <laughs> I go crazy. I start reminiscing. So, yeah, I mean, um, those were the good times. What can you say? I know, right? All right, we're going to try. Did I miss anything? I, okay, vodka, uh, the watermelon, the lime, the cucumber syrup, ice, and shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. And With, then that little special hot. That oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And jalapeno, she added a little side, yeah, well, a little we're side we're piece. Gonna, <laughs> We're going to kick it up so it won't be so sweet. She had a little side piece called jalapeno. You don't have to put the jalapeno in. That was not little. But make it spicy. Had a, we yeah. have a garden full of jalapenos. It, it makes it spicy. A lot of jalapenos. And cucumbers. These oh. cucumbers okay, G. came out of our garden. I don't know what happened to this one. He got a little malnourished. He's fat, but he's not very long. If you like it, it looks fat, more you like, like a, um, you like it fat, or you like it long. It looks more like a what do you call the thing? Um, the other one, kind of the shape of an eggplant or something, isn't it? Yeah. So, kinda, do you like your cucumber? I like them fat. I, I or like them like long. I like them. Can you get both? <laughs> do I have to pick one or the other? I like them both. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. So, she can she can decide herself. Tell her to get on back. Let's get on back on them drinks. Okay. So listen, we're gonna we shake this up. We're gonna strain it, and we're gonna uh oh uh oh. Uh -oh. See, uh -oh. see, now this is why you need another bar towel. You never know when it's gonna come in handy. All right. Here we go. Okay. We're gonna strain these martinis. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hold it. Okay. So it she, there you go. Oh. Still made a mess. Mm, that's some good liquor going to waste. Child. It looks good though. It looks it looks pretty. It looks delicious. It looks cold. It looks it's appetizing. Cold. It looks alluring. Alright, there we go. All the things. We're gonna clean up our all the things we like. Clean up the mess I made. 
Girl. I haven't had a drink yet. I'm making a mess. Mm -hmm. Oh, figure. All right. All right. We ready? We're going to garnish with a little bit of a little bit of melon. Oh, let's do one of these beautiful cucumbers. I've already washed them. Oh, that'll be cool. So, um, this cucumber, <clears throat> fresh out the garden. I used to eat cucumbers every every day for lunch or for like weeks. So, I haven't done that in a while, and hmm, I, I like it. Um, I like the baby cucumbers. I like the mini ones. Oh yeah, those yeah. are a lot sweeter. Yeah, tender. they are more tender, more uh -huh. sweet. So I, I got hooked on baby cucumbers, and would just uh, eat them like chips. So, oh, it ooh, that is that is that is range. that is that is hot. Yeah, it's something about that that just looks I don't know sexy or something. Maybe it's just me. Okay, should I get my own? Cause you're gonna, gonna you're not gonna spill it, are you? I'm gonna okay. hand it to you. So we have our cucumber, wrong button, watermelon martini in our traditional martini glass. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We have right. two more martinis to make, y'all. So oh yeah, this is, we, we have a. A variety of martinis today. We gotta, we gotta get to drinking. Yeah. Hmm. That's good. I can taste the jalapeno. Oh man. Yes. I'm glad I put that in there. It's a little kick. Oh, just a slight kick. Yeah. Just a tiny, tiny kick on the back of your tongue. Mm. Not a lot. Mm. Delicious. All, All right. right. We have two more to go. So here we go. I'm about to put this to the side. Okay. I'm All right. Okay. I'm definitely okay. drinking this right now. One more sip and then. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. So oh, I like that spice in it. You, are you going to leave it? I don't know. I'm going to try to leave it here. You're going to line it up? Okay. I'm so going to line them up. Yeah, that's a good idea. All so right. Which one? Which uh, the coup? We're going with the, uh, uh, we're going with the copper glass next. Copper. Okay. okay. So this, what, what flavor is this one? This one is gonna be our Mexican martini. Okay. Mexican this is kind of like a, kind of like a. Oh, like a flight or like, like a margarita. A, oh, 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 oh. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. So this one's okay. gonna be. You know, we talked about specialty martinis. It doesn't necessarily have to be gin or vodka. So this okay. one's gonna be with tequila. So we're gonna put four ounces of tequila. You know, the only uh, martini that I had that did not have gin or vodka in it that I didn't particularly care for, I did not care for the um, cognac. There's a Thai restaurant that we go to, and they serve. They have one of their specialty martinis as a cognac. I, that's the only one that I just did. I don't know. It just didn't have the oh, martini. Oh, I liked. I, I liked it. It did not have a martini vibe can you to give me, me. Can you give me a different shaker over there? And please? so I just couldn't get with it. It's got that watermelon in there. Just a hand. Can you have me a different shaker, please? Over there on the end. Sorry, I wasn't prepared. <laughs> we got to do three martinis. I forgot, so I need shakers. You, need, you, you probably need You can bring them all. One. Bring them all. I'm going to need more shakers. Oh, that's a big mamma jamma. Yeah. My, Where am I making the mamma jamma? I don't know. I'll do this one. Or the mini. The mini one might be. You can bring them over. Come on over. Come on over. <laughs> Let me have that one too. Okay, thank you. There's a magic arm coming from. Okay, so let's see here. We've got about the. Let's go with this one. All right, so we need. Four ounces of tequila. So this one has, this is the, oh, this is the Mexican. Mexican margarita. Mexican, no, no okay. martini. Every time I Everything say tequila, okay, I okay, I know. Okay, okay, so Mexican martini. Yep, it's throwing okay. it off because we used to like uh Oh, I think, I think I heard about this one. So this, is this the one with a little bit of olive juice? Yes. Yes. Okay, this one's going to be good. So it's a Mexican martini. And it has, uh, so it's, 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 the ingredients are basically like a, um, uh, an original, right? Original martini or a lime martini. And then the a kick to it is, uh, or kind of like a margarita rather, the kick to <laughs> it is the lime, uh, the olive juice and tequila and the triple sec, all those together, that's what really kind of twists it. Okay. Yeah. So, I remember this one now. So let me see, we put... Two ounces of triple set. Stop drinking this Four one. ounces of tequila. Now I need some fresh squeezed lime juice. How much? Ooh. Okay, where's my... That is it? good. I would probably put a little more jalapeno in mine, because you know I like mine spicy. Yeah, you know what? I tasted that, and I was like, okay, I don't want to do it too spicy, but yeah. yeah. I can cut you up a piece of you know what? in there. A, or a floater. Yep. You know, put, have a few floating in the top. Hey. 
Yeah, that's no problem. I'm gonna cut you one now. That uh, see to make a difference. But these jalapenos are hot. It's funny because mm -hmm. they all come from the same bush, mm -hmm. but some are really hot and some have and some no heat at all. So we're gonna see. You should make some. Uh, make sure you make some pico de gallo. My the cilantro didn't do right this year. Oh, you know what? I think you told me that cilantro is one of the hardest it's vegetables really hard. It's really hard to, grow. to grow. Okay, so listen, y'all. I only tried once, and she wanted. Wait a minute. Okay. <laughs> you want both? You said uh, two on there. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, y'all do your thing. Now see, that's pretty. I wish the I wish the camera can pick that up with the two. Um, can you get that with the two jalapenos floating in the top? That's that red. That um. She gonna be on fire. Green. Somebody get a bottle of water ready. That green floating in the red. Ooh. I can smell it. Can you smell it? I can smell it. Yes. All right, so we have <laughs> some lime juice in here. We need mm. an ounce of fresh squeezed orange Ooh. juice. That that little bit made a difference. That quick. Really? Yes. A lot a yeah. big difference because I'm gonna put some in mine. Not a big I would probably suggest doing one instead of two. I should have just did one, but I was greedy and wanted two slices. Yeah, it's, it, it's amazing how quickly it changed the drink to make it spicy and hot. Yeah, that's what I was Just trying that quick. to do initially. That quick. That's, that's amazing to me. We're going to put some mm. fresh orange oh. juice in here from the world's driest orange. I need a big um, bottle of water after this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The other day I <laughs> ate one for yeah. dinner and it was like, uh-uh, uh, that's too spicy. How did you have it? I grilled some and had it with some oh. grilled pork chops, okay. just, you know, on the side. Okay. And so mine wasn't actually hot. My husband tricked me. He was like, he kept saying, oh, my jalapeno is so hot. And I'm like eating mine. I'm like, it's not hot. He's a little baby, right? I'm like, why is he keep talking about this? Then he said, here, taste mine. He gave me a little piece. Mm -hmm. Girl, I had to drink water. I had to get up, get some ice cream, put on my tongue. I See, kept... that is so crazy because it came out of the same garden. The same, it's the same, same bush. Yeah. What, same bush? Yeah. Wow. That Just is like really, that. That is really Jesus. insane. I could, it was I have like, never heard that before. It was a little piece like big as your little baby fingernail, but it set my soul on <laughs> fire. See, I don't, I, you know what? I <clears throat> I like spicy drinks. I like spicy food, but I don't like it so hot that you took, because to me, you can't taste it. If your mouth is on fire, how are you tasting the food? I, I never have been able to uh, to, to, to grasp Well, that, it, me it so. messed up the rest of my meal. Let me just say that. See, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. To me, it would just change the taste of everything. It would be so hot, you can't even taste anything. So so we're going to put a splash of olive juice in here. So splash. now I've, I've, I've been running my mouth. I forgot the um, ingredients. So we've got tequila. Tequila. We've got triple set. Did I put triple set? Did um, I see you put triple set in here? I didn't see you put triple set in there. So oh, well. I would just, I would err on, I would, you know, on the side of not and just put some in there anyway. So rather have it than not have it. Well, right? Okay, we'll see. A little extra chip of sex that won't hurt, but I don't remember seeing you put it in there. Well, it's in there now. I'm telling you, I am famous for leaving out a drink. I realized after when I'm chasing, I'm like, I didn't put something in here. But anyway, okay, so we're going to shake this up. So this doesn't get ice. Yeah, I should have ice. Oh, so the ice goes in the glass. No, the ice should be in the shaker. Oh, but okay. I was so busy um, talking about jalapenos. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm all out of whack. Okay, so we're going to put some ice in here. We're almost done with this uh, Mexican martini. You know what? Remember when I was, I, at one point, probably, I don't know, maybe five or seven years ago, I was hooked on a, a white martini, white chocolate martini so, uh, made with Godiva. Too sweet for me. Really so uh, yeah, I was I was crazy into that for a while. Now what I what I've never really cared for, I've never cared for a chocolate martini. Mm -hmm. Is that I've the same? Cared, no. Well, well, I think because white chocolate is more sweeter. So mm -hmm. I don't know. It's just you would think that they're they're similar, but white chocolate to me has a better taste. I've never did really get into the chocolate martini or a coffee martini. You ever had a coffee martini? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there was co a coffee martini. They throw they throw the coffee bean in it. I, yeah, I have I it. have not had it, but I don't know if that would be my my jam. So now one one thing that I didn't do and it's a critical mistake is I didn't chill martini glass. You want to make sure you chill your martini glasses. Well, you know because of our setup. If, if we didn't have this setup yeah. and you were in a traditional bar uh, with a you know with a sink and and and, and ice bucket 
you know, ice trough, you would have been able to do that. That was, I used to love to do that. I would fill a glass up with ice and then put it in water and then kind of swirl it around some. Chill it. So, yeah. yeah. So, uh, so we're just, you know, it's just a Mexican martini. We're going to rim and it's made with tequila. We're going to rim the glass. I don't know quick. if I've ever had a martini made with tequila. Wow. First time for everything. I think this might be the first time. A martini made with tequila. I don't think so. So you rimmed it yep. with salt or sugar? Salt. Oh, oh. Okay, here we go. That's that's really blowing my mind. I can't wait to taste this. Okay. Huh. Interesting, because it kind it, it kind like of a, look like a margarita. margarita. Yeah. yeah, that's what it looks like. Yeah, that's it looks like a margarita. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's see. What are we garnishing this with? Oh, I have a skewer of olives. Oh, you showing off now. Yep. Yeah. Get our skewer of olives on there. Oh, that looks so perfect. All right. That looks so, so there perfect. we have it. This Ooh, is our second have country a whole martini. Line up over here. I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let me move this one over a little bit. All right. How are we looking? Okay. Martini number two. Oh, martini number two. All right. Cheers. Okay. All right. Let me see here. I don't even know where to dig in. I want a little bit of salt. Don't want a lot of olive first. Ooh. That's like a potent uh, margarita. Ooh. See the olive. Wow. That's, <laughs> mm, that is very interesting. Eat an olive. Oh. Mm. I, I, you know what? So I like this one better than the watermelon because it's I nice do. sweet. Yeah. Okay. I, I like them for different reasons. Yeah. But that's, this is really good. This, that's what it reminds me of. It reminds me of a margarita. That's good. So that's martini number two. Oh, man. All right. And we've got there in our specialty copper martini glass, a traditional V-shape. Ooh. And so, when she finished. And finish, then when you taste the olive, <laughs> taste the olive and take a little sip of the drink. With that olive, it makes it really Lights good. out. Lights mm -hmm. out. Mm hmm Oh, my gosh. Okay. So these are. Now, you got to top yourself. Now, this was good. This might be a little bit better. Uh oh. So now uh -oh. I'm going to put my foot and my what? Oh. Uh, both feet. That look both feet. feet. Okay. All right. So this is our coupe glasses. We're going to use that to make our, our last martini. It's a pineapple martini. All right. So here we go. Okay. Wait a minute. Is something up in there? Ooh. Which one is that? This one? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Let me calm down. Let me calm down, America. <laughs> I'm getting too excited. Right. And then I'm going to jump back over here because this is... Ah! Oh, bless you. me. Bless you. This is kind of salty and sweet. and sweet. And this one is sweet and hot. Dang. Let me see. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know. All right. Man, well, we got I one more to go. Back in the lead now. All right. So we have one more to go. We're okay. going to go with... Let back. me calm down. What are we doing now? We're back on some vodka. Oh, that ain't vodka. vodka. Get the right thing. So what's the name of this one? This one's a, just a pineapple martini. Pineapple martini. Okay, just straight. No no fa fancy twists. No uh, secret ingredients. No. Mm, you, um, never, you never know. You I don't see. When you're messing know. around with you, you might do anything. You never know. You know what? This is why she makes the best drinks. <laughs> Whenever we have a, a party, family gathering, no matter what um, event that we have, everybody in the family always call on this one because she makes the absolute best drinks you can't duplicate them because she just kind of she just has, i can't even duplicate them she just she just has that gift <laughs> and she just kind of she can taste it and figure out okay i don't i don't that that flavor profile is missing something and then she'll grab this and she'll do that and then she'll grab something else and when she's done everybody in the party is like get some more of that drink get some more of that drink she has to make three or four batches and it's just because all that little special twist. And if I come back, come back six months later, I might not be. It might not taste <laughs> the same because I might, I might not. Even though she follows the same recipe, I tell her stop doing all those little tricky, sneaky stuff and putting extra sneak. sneak. I'm like, you know, that's what Mama does with her cooking. With her cooking, she yeah. never tells you exactly everything she puts in the recipe. 
She'll give you the recipe, but then she has one little sneaky turn or twist. Now, it's not, or, it's not well, that it's, really. Well, I just, I just I like know. I'm mixing. I'm in the moment. Well, and I'm, she keeps well, the you might be doing. Okay. But she keeps oh, a mama, secret. Mama sneaky. She keep one sneak. She keep one secret ingredient, so yours will not taste exactly like hers because she's gonna throw that pro tip in there. So anyway. all right, so we're gonna add some pineapple juice. Three ounces of pineapple okay. juice. That one's still good. Which one? This one is still good. It's still sweet. And some of you wants a little something salty and sour. Not sour, but salty. So you're uh, still mixing. Then you, jump, <laughs> then you jump over here. So, I don't know. This might not turn out. This might be a long evening. Come on. I'm looking. You guys, I was trying to see if you had watermelon on your teeth and lipstick. It looks like lipstick. Okay, mm. yeah. I'm like, you, okay. you drink it too hard. You got watermelon on your teeth. Okay, mm. so we have four ounces of vodka. Three ounces of pineapple mm. juice. Oh, triple set. I got oh, lipstick. Boy. I'm getting so carried away. I got lipstick all over my your lips and stuff. Slapping and drinking and slurping and sucking and all that. Mm. <laughs> you do, <laughs> you're doing too much. I'm doing okay. Too much. I'm truly doing too much. All right, let's put some okay. ice in this. So this is vodka. This is our last freshly martini. And a vodka, pineapple juice, triple set, and, and triple set. And, and you made the pineapple juice. Yes. Yes, you made the pineapple juice from scratch. Took some fresh pineapple, blended it up with no, no, some simple syrup. Yeah, yeah. A little yeah. simple syrup. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay, so we got our ingredients in there. You oh, man. This is the last know. one. I, I think. Bam. Uh, I think wait, 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 wait. I'm going to shake it up in there. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. You can't have two spices, can you? Why not? Can we do it? Can we have more than one spicy? Okay. I say, yeah, I'm just going to put a little slice in there. Cause I think that's gonna be kind of sweet. Oh, I wonder if you should put some pickle juice in it. Pickle, pineapple? Oh, you no, gonna put it cool? Is that gonna no, no, we're no. gonna put it on okay. the jalapeno. Cause it's like we got sweet, we've got salty. It's like we need something a little sour. Yeah, I didn't get the spicy because I didn't put the jalapeno in mine. Uh, so I don't want some spicy. Okay. Gotta keep it spicy. All right, here we go. Let me see. I got everything in there. Yep, yep, yep. All right. That sounds like that's gonna be good. Oh, cause what was it? Was it last summer or summer before last when I was doing when I was into my uh, spicy jalapeno pineapple margaritas? So this would be like that, except it's a martini made with vodka, right? If you put the jalapeno in there. Yep. Similar. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Here we go. We're gonna see. Okay. Uh, oh. oh looking, okay. Looking good. Looking like it's supposed to look. Got the little nice pineapple uh, color. Looking good. It is looking good. We're gonna see if that jalapeno is gonna set us. So you did fire. put it in there. I didn't see you put it in there. I put one little slice, but oh. you was carrying on about the spice. <laughs> we're gonna go I know, I need to calm down. Pineapple I'm getting too excited. You know what, should I put some? We okay. got jalapeno in that one, right? So I, I mean, do. So, so you put jalapeno in yours. Okay, you yep. do that. All right. Mm. All right, I want to float this cucumber in there. Uh -oh. Look at me. I'm scared. Look at my jalapeno slice. I gave mm. her big, thick slices. Okay. That's good. I'm going to warm it up. Put me some jalapeno in there. Woo! Ooh, that looks pretty, too. Yes. Okay, so here we go. Our last special oh, martini. Okay. Last we got one. A pineapple martini with vodka, yep. set, fresh pineapple juice. And we put a little. Uh, Jalapeno in there to spice it up a bit. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go, my friends. Right. Okay. I can smell the pineapple. Hmm. This tastes way different than I thought. Me too. I think this I one is strong. It tastes stronger to you. It tastes stronger to it me than the rest of them. To me, I always think I need some more vodka. <laughs> She needs more vodka. Oh, I'm not mad at you, but I. Hmm. This one. Okay. Oh my. I'm slobbering and carrying on. For whatever reason, <laughs> maybe I just had too much. For whatever reason, it seems like I can really taste the vodka in this one. I don't taste it. So. Okay. All right. We're going to judge. We're going to oh, evaluate man. from you which one you like the best. Okay. So on a scale of one to ten, we're going to rate these. Why don't you say which one you like the best? No, one. I go. Oh, mm, I have to do it. Well, ooh, do it ooh, your ooh. way. Do it ooh, your way. Okay, I'm going to do a scale of 1 to 10 because, you know, I have to break it down like that. Okay, well, break it down then. So, I'm going to this one. I'm going to give, this is hard. 
I'm going to give you a nine. I'm going to give you a nine. I'll say this is a nine. This one, I'm going to give a 9.3. Maybe six. 9.6. Let me see. Let me see. Uh oh, one more taste. Final taste. Mm. No, 9.6. Okay. You're going to get a 9.6. This was a nine, nine point six. Okay. Okay, let me try this one. Mmm, that's strong. <laughs> Even though it's strong. Why is that strong to me? It's weird. I'm gonna have to give you an eight point five. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna give you eight point five. I don't know. It's um, uh, it's good, but these two are just speaking to me more. That's all. See, I will reverse. I will make this one my higher point value. That's this and one. then I will go with okay. the watermelon. I think we still agree on this one. There's something not quite There's something for me. I don't know. And it's... it may have been because I couldn't remember if I put the uh, triple <laughs> syrup in or not. No, I mean triple <laughs> set. Triple set. And to put some more in it because something is throwing that pineapple flavor off. But anyway, so here we go. Here we go. Uh, specialty martinis. All right. Uh, shaken, not stirred. No, yep. yeah, shaken, not stirred. Mm -hmm. And, you know, like we talked about the different uh, martini glasses, the coupe. Versus the traditional V, or you know, also v. the stimulus glasses have come into play. You know what I do? That's one thing I need to add to my collection. I do not have any stimulus martini glasses. If anybody <laughs> needs a stimulus martini glass, she does, because she's gonna uh, don't knock tell. over, break something. Don't tell my what happens all the time. I'm just saying you need a, you need the stimulus. <laughs> I should get you a set of stimulus glasses. I do. All my glasses are stimulus except my drink glasses. Oh, okay. So, so there you have it, our specialty martinis, taking advantage of our cucumbers out the garden, mm. our jalapenos. Oh, I put that in there. <coughs> no, I'm doing too much now. So watermelon, watermelon, oranges, yep. lime, everything. Yeah, the whole garden. Yeah. Uh, the whole garden, no fruit stand. So. <laughs> anyway, thank you we so much. We finished out our summer with a bang. I know, right? <laughs> thank you so much for joining us. Um, if you like what you see, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. That helps our channel to grow. We typically uh, like to upload uh, videos once a week. Now that her so, foot is healed, almost. So, yeah, so we're, we'll so we're going to get back to that. We're going to get back on our schedule. Yeah. So um, thank you again. If you like what you see, share it with someone else. And until the next time, have some of these martinis. <laughs> have some of that fresh fruit. Yeah. And just do it. Yes. Do it. Do it. 8.899. Yeah. 9.6. 9.6. 8.5 or whatever you 8. say. 8.5. I'm going to finish out with 8.5. Right. See y'all next right. time.